Hi. We're going to Chuck E. Cheese today. Chuck E. Cheese's was founded in 1977 by Nolan Bushnell, who also happened to be the founder of Atari. Bushnell used to drive to different pizza places around the Bay Area with Atari co-founder Ted Dabney to brainstorm ideas for what would later become the very first Chuck E. Cheese's Pizza Time Theater. The original location would go on to open in San Jose, California. Which would have been right over here. I uh, may have miscalculated the location. That's it. Let's go down the street a little. It's around this area where the original Chuck E. Cheese's would have stood in all its glory. It has since been replaced with an outdoor shopping center known as Santana Row. I'm kind of wondering if I can find the exact location where it stood, but it might be a little difficult. So according to our calculations, I don't know if it's correct or not, but the original location would have been somewhere in this particular area. The original location was 370 South Winchester Boulevard. That says 350 South Winchester, so uh, maybe it's like a combined building? I'll put a before and after picture and you guys tell me what you think. Unfortunately, a lot of former Chuck E. Cheese locations have closed down, but there's still one in San Jose that is two stories of fun. As you're driving on the 101 freeway, you can't miss it. A 30-foot Charles Entertainment Cheese waves at commuters, letting them know a small bit of their childhood is still standing. Originally, this building was home to the Magic Village Toy Store, which opened in 1974. The three large windows featured a display of toy soldiers, which were then sent back to the original owner once the store closed down. It was then briefly transformed into a discotheque before reopening as the Pizza Time Theater in 1981. Oh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> well, what do we do first? <laughs> I don't know. It's like we're 10 year olds again. Okay. My new car. Points or minutes? Points. I guess points. Uneven. Yeah, I'm not sure. sure what that hell means. Spend two more dollars, get a dollar free. Uh, sure, why not? Uh, just that one. Ooh. <laughs> All you can play for. Oh, yep, yeah. <laughs> okay. Let's go play. Yeah. I do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Somebody's in here. Oh, hello. <laughs> Reliving their childhood. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna jump in here with you. There's enough room for all of us. Oh, Toad! <laughs> hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. Oh, I guess like a coins. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Oh. Oh, like this 
snake vibrates. Oh, it does? Yeah. Oh, wow. This has Nintendo tech. <laughs> I guess some of the machines still do give out physical tickets, which is really cool. The other ones, I don't know. We'll figure it out. <laughs> You're good again. <laughs> well, you got lunch. Yeah. I used to get him and was it Grimace? Oh yeah. From McDonald's. Yeah. I used to get those two mixed up all the time. I, I can see why. <laughs> I want to keep it. I know. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a lot of food. I think we're good with this. Yeah. This is your first time having a Chuck E. Cheese pizza. Yeah, because the first time I went to a Chuck E. Cheese, I didn't get it. Well, we didn't get any of the food while we were there. We were just there for like five minutes or so. No. So, yeah, I, we just... I've heard mixed things. I'm here to disprove those things. Okay. <laughs> oh, Rob. <laughs> Looks cheesy. Good? It was very cheesy. <laughs> the cheese pool. <laughs> Very cheesy. Kind of reminds me of Little Caesars. Yeah, kind of. It does kind of taste like Little Caesars pizza. Uh, but yeah, I think it's good too. <laughs> <laughs> whoa! <laughs> oh my god, the cheese yeah, pool. Whoa. Won't even separate. It's so satisfying though. Yeah. The marinara. Good? That's really good, actually. <laughs> good luck. Everything is like amazingly cheesy. Chuck E. Cheese is really living up to its name. <laughs> so I see. Can I have the marinara with it? Yeah. Here. I think they gave us blue cheese also, or ranch. I think so. That's really good. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I think Chucky's about to come out right now. Is it bad that I'm like super excited? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kind of anticipating something. Chucky, he's just gonna be on the screen. Okay. Oh. 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 can't see oh. how well we're doing. Come on. Like we're well, not you're doing, doing better than me, but. Yeah. Well, overall, we're not doing bad. Oh, 
on flares. Oh, oh, well, she was a jump scare. Yeah, you know, they were in the arcade too. Oh, they have someone well. right there. That was fun. That was fun. <laughs> as impressive as this Chuck E. Cheese is, I kind of want to see if I can find one that has the animatronics in it because the one that I grew up going to had like the full on animatronic show and this one has just that dance floor area which is cool but uh, I was expecting a lot more live action stuff I guess but we're gonna go see if we can go find another Chuck E. Cheese, maybe the one that I used to go to as a little kid, and see if they still have the animatronics. If not, then I'm gonna be very heartbroken. But let's go! So we're at the one that I grew up going to, and where I'm standing now is where the animatronic stage would have been. They would have all the like characters come out and do their little musical show. <laughs> it's all gone! And right here would have been the ball pit area where that like gym was for everybody to run around in. Mm -hmm. I guess all the Chuck E. Cheese locations have changed to this more modernized look. At least they have a dance floor here. It's not as interactive as the one in San Jose. But uh... Oh my gosh. <laughs> like a wake-up call. I know. <laughs> but we're gonna make the most out of it. Yes, we will. So I wanted to show you guys this because when I came here as a little girl, I sat right there next to Chucky and this takes a picture of you. I guess now it's in color, but when I did it, it was in black and white. I don't know if I still have them because I think it faded over time, but at least this is still here. Joseph's gonna play the ski ball at this one. This is the ski ball I remember, like the very 90s. Like this. I know. So, it looks a little old. Ah! Uh, I got 4,000 at one point. It's the same machine from when I was young. It probably is. Looks like it. The eight tickets? Uh, 16. Oh. Sweet. Cool. Oh my gosh, here is our childhood. I mean, I don't think we should have been watching Simpsons. We shouldn't have but been, but I think we both did. We yeah. Watch it. You want to try? Let's see how this works. Does it... Oh, jeez. Oh, oh my Carlos. gosh. Oh, okay. <laughs> you have to That's kick the. Like, like... <laughs> so, my... Okay, I need to go. Oh, Homer's the goalie. That's... You have to make it past him. There you go. I was gonna say, you played soccer yeah. when you were young. Your ranking is Lisa, so Lisa's a ranking. Oh, wow. Why won't anyone give me an award? Oh. <laughs> See how bad I am at football. At least just throwing one. <laughs> kind of high up. Yeah. Just saying. Oh, you almost got the long bomb. Hey, you got it. <laughs> I'm still a rookie. Yeah. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> What did we do that we got a thousand points? <laughs> Holy cow. No idea what we did. We, we got some bonuses. I didn't think we got that much. So what do you say? Do you think loading points is more worth it or loading time? Like the minutes. I'm going to say the minutes. Yeah, actually I will say the minutes because even though the minutes doesn't let you like keep doing it to like add on where you're doing something like the yeah. Wizard of Well, it let both of us play at the same time. Yeah, it did. So. So. I feel like it's more worth it because then you can kind of run around and do more without freaking out that your points are going to run out. Yeah, that if you're with somebody else, like, you know, it's two of us and you're playing one thing, then it still wouldn't let me do it right away while you were playing, but yeah. after a little bit, let me do it. Yeah, so just a little tip for anyone. Because, yeah. yeah, we had, that was a lot of fun. Yeah. You happy? 
Yes. <laughs> You're welcome. So this location, the one that I grew up at, they have the option if, I guess, you don't have enough points for something that you really, really want, and it's only specifically for the Chuck E. Cheese merchandise, you can purchase it. And if you do have tickets from like other locations, they'll still redeem it to your points at this location here. I don't know if they all do that, because the location that we were just at didn't like have the option to buy the other you know merchandise that you wanted. So what they did is they took the tickets that we already had and it applied it as a discount on the merchandise we wanted. So we got him discounted. I'm super happy. <laughs> <laughs> Healing inner child. Yes, I am. <laughs> So we're gonna wrap it up here. Hopefully this inspired you to go out and heal your inner child. And as ridiculous as I did feel at the beginning, now I just kind of feel like that was a lot of fun and that was totally worth it. And who cares what other people think? You only have this one life to live. So until next time, I hope you guys join me on the next adventure. Bye.